Josh, you made it. After 12 damn years, you don't have to show up to that place anymore. That damn place. I mean, I'm finally free to do as I please, yet I feel trapped within myself. Hey, Josh. How long are you gonna be in there? I kinda need to use the bathroom. Hey, I'll be out in a minute. Hey, what's up, man? Yeah, yeah, I'll be right there. Great. College has been pretty good. How about you? Uh, I don't know, man. Everything's kind of weird. You know, I feel free from that place, but at the same time, I'm, I feel trapped. It, everything kind of depends on me this time, and it's, it's a weird experience. <sighs> I get you, bro, but, you know, chill. Everything's gonna be fine. I mean, now that the job of high school is over, you know, it's gonna be fine. How's life? Life's been pretty good, you know, with graduation, final exams, college acceptance or denial letters. Whoa, college denial letters? All right, that's that's not a thing that happens in your life, Josh. What, two out of the two colleges you applied to? You've had a 3.9 GPA your whole high school career. How does that happen? Jesus. Well, since you all graduated, I've been by myself and, you know, I really needed the support from y'all. It's been a weird journey, so yeah, my GPA has gone down a bit, but uh, I got the GPA good enough to get into the school that I want to with a scholarship, and uh, I'm going into the city of my dreams, so I should be happy, shouldn't I? I know it's late, man, but I really wanted to be here for that. I know you needed me, man. Well, why weren't you? I mean, other than Carla, you really only had the person that I trusted, and I needed you, and you know, you never came home. I had to finish school. I had to stay sane. Well, I'm sorry for not being here. I know you needed me, but now that I'm here, I can help you let it go. I don't think I could ever. Dude, you need to. I don't want to. Please, you must. Dude, just fucking go. Josh, go. Dude, you know what? Fuck this, man. Don't understand. You don't understand. I've, you've been in my life, and now that you're gone, I just I don't know what to do. Josh, you need to get your shit together. This is your future we're talking about. You're going to a great school, and you have to do your best like you always have. I can't. Josh, you must. I, I can't. Oh, shut up. You are the smartest, brightest, and most charismatic person I know. You'll get over it. You'll have an amazing life. You'll be happy. And I'll always be there for you. Josh, I love you. And I know you love me. But if you don't leave, I'll never forgive myself.
Thanks for coming, man. I would uh, let you do this by yourself, man. You know what's funny? I haven't seen you in a long time, and uh, this is probably going to be the last time I see you for a while now. That's... That's pretty funny. Yeah. You know, I'm, I'm very sorry about what happened earlier. It's fine, man. Don't worry about it. I'm supposed to be there for you. But you're here now, man. I'm thankful for that. Hey. What? You wanna head out here? Sure. Yeah, sure, man. Get in the car. Let's, let's go check out this place. She was supposed to be here. This was supposed to be a life-changing moment for the three of us. Our last night together. I love you, Carla. I miss you so much. We both do bad. Both do. Thanks, bro. Look at how I'm gonna miss this place. Look at me. You're gonna be fine, alright? You're gonna be fine. Hey Josh, how long are you gonna be in there? I kinda need to use the bathroom. Hey, I'll be out in a minute.